All right. Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only. How all my adventures doing? Welcome back. Uh, this is um, a new server. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I have that. I don't really have that in my bag. Get rid of that. I guess that's a little testing they've done. But um, yeah, welcome back to the channel. This is the private server, uh, Newcraft. Grand Potato Newcraft. So usually I do do like the first island and go through all of it just to see if there's anything different. They do have commands here, which is like interesting. So the first command is at, there is something called it at. I have not found. So I guess it puts every last item you have inside of your uh, bag into your archive. That's one. They also have another one to where you can unlock the camera, I guess. At soon. Lock. I guess I won't. Nah, that, that one didn't work. I spell it right? I spelled it right. That one doesn't work. What about... I, I just wanted to try some things here. No fog. Ah, okay, that one works. The pretty neat stuff that you can do to remove, like, nuisance type of thing. I wonder if you do it again. Okay, you can add it back if you like it. But if you don't like the fog, you can just do that and get rid of it. They have another one called No Lag, which removes damage and sounds. And another one that uh, removes floors, which is interesting. I say this is the first server I've seen with like actual public like commands. Oh, this one doesn't work. No at floors does not work. Okay, yeah, so you can't use inside that party. You actually have to. Um, then they have one with no effect. They probably removed some of these commands. No models. Yeah, at no models does not work. And no effects. Okay, so you can remove like anything else. So no effects as in no like <laughs> water effects or anything else that would cause you to lag. Which is actually pretty nice. As I especially if you're on like a lower end PC. I'd say that's a good uh, little ad. But uh, this is mostly a Chinese server, I will say that. That is one thing that should be known here. And it follows more along the lines of the official server with the um, with the remakes. And when I mean the remakes, I mean the reworks. Is that another bar? Oh, okay, no, it's just the graphic glitch. But, um, yeah. It's basically gonna fall down the same line as the reworks from the official server. Uh, with a little bit of, like, nerfs and stuff, I guess. Like, uh, you guys already know how I feel about the reworks. Uh, Druid reworks is, is more of, like, a... Jury work is something interesting. <laughs> it's kind of like it forces you to have like a teammate. Because all their skills are situational. 
like all of their skills are pr protective abilities and it seems like in the moment abilities to where you have to use it then and there because they only last for like a few seconds and their cooldowns are like 30 seconds but everything they do where there was healing uh if i had to say the best thing to start with when it comes to like rework druid is probably leaning towards more magic still because one of the major things that you're gonna see is the fact that um all of druid skills still oh all of their passives still come into line with magic base let me show you like this is still magic base like well actually hold on yeah it reduces magic damage received oh no increases magic damage received whoops my bad don't know how to read but one thing is is this now has damage on it as well I haven't played the official version in so long that I'm not really sure uh, a lot of things of what's changed. Then again, there's another thing with the private server to where with the private service to where they change something, but it doesn't translate in game, which confuses the hell out of me sometimes. Uh, let me use this. I did tell you guys we we're gonna try out the the next official server just to see what's up with with this before um, you know anything happens if it closes down or anything like that because like I said, left and right servers stay up for like a month, then randomly just close. Just really depends on their popularity, I think. But um, interestingly enough, we got a lot of the. Uh, the buffs I do like, the reworks I do like. Um, there is one that I talked about that helps out Druid a lot in all of its forms. I think you get it at Mystic, right? Where is it? No, that's not it. Is it a Druid? Is it really a Druid? Or am I just overlooking looking at that much? Um, Holy Gift, I think, is the passive that we got inside of Rewind. Let it go. So I did talk about it a lot. Sadly, Grill Guard is now a uh, 15 second buff you don't get the most out of that anymore i wonder if they changed the talents or if maybe they kept it the same at this point considering all the reworks are here i don't think they changed it either. this this right here is why magic is probably your best bet to go down because of this this ability right here Oh, no, 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 that's not, that's not it. Where, where is it? Yeah, what it looks like, man. Well, bird form is like very OP. That, that's why I would say, just to make that a lot easier, because I'm still searching for the other ability. I guess you get that shaman. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I forgot. It, it changed uh, icons. This is now this. Converting like damage over to another form and stuff like that is great this is this is the ability i was talking about that i really loved out of the whole rework i guess i should start uh <laughs> start grinding now instead of uh talking so much
Oh shit. There's only two guilds from what I see. Uh, some of these words probably won't come in right because it is translated to Chinese and I don't have any Chinese like text. So there could be a little bit of bugs there. I know there's a way I can actually like get the Chinese letters, but I don't want to. <laughs> Damn, has that always been like 12 seconds? Low level 100. Wait, hey, whoa. That's been adjusted. Pretty sure that's been adjusted because that. Hmm. Low 100. Yeah, that's definitely been adjusted. So we don't get a mount on this at all. So we're kind of walking through. Uh. They've also been reworking weapons, but they reworked this to where it's supposed to be 50, no, 25% crit chance, I think. I think it's this weapon, right? Or is it the orange? No, I'm pretty sure it's this. Um, magic. But yeah, like I said, the rework for bird form is like very strong. It, it is definitely one of the faster clears in the game. Just because you can spam a projectile forward that hits all in a line. So this server does have the times five XP. It seems to be a trend. And it's on by default. It's not like an event thing. I believe so at least. Hold on. I think I still have the Discord up, right? At least I think it's on. Maybe it is an event thing. Seems like they do it after every event too. After as a uh, same as memories. At least I think so. The only downfall is that I don't like so far is that the launcher stays up in your background with the password showing. Along with the user. I, I don't like that. That that needs to be... Kinda... Well, not even kinda. Definitely needs to be looked into. The launcher should definitely minimize... As an icon. So just keep that in mind if you're gonna play this on like... A stream or something that that can happen does it seem like whoops ah forgot to change my little pet peeve I use I for inventory But it doesn't seem like they changed any of the rewards or anything like that so far. Uh, once we get to the main city, that's where we'll be able to see what's truly going on there. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> We're 
gonna go to him first. So it makes you wonder, did they go down the route? Oh yeah, I forgot that there's this weird path thing for that one too that makes us go right there and it runs all the way back. But um What was I about to say? Hold on. I gotta keep these going. Cause I keep forgetting about those. But uh, my concern right now is what if, what if they really change and how old is this server for it to have like a lot of players like this? Because there's a well, can't even say a lot of players. There's a lot of uh... oh yeah, there's not many players. But there's a lot of Discord people, which is interesting. You have like a, over a thousand live Discord players. Which is interesting. And it seems like they went down the route of uh, memories as well. To where it is a big payout. To where... Spend a hundred dollars you get 60,000 AP. Not only that, a lot of this stuff is pretty cheap. I never knew there was emotes that you can buy. That's interesting. I say there were a few people talking earlier in the day when I was testing it and making sure everything was good. Curious about the XP for uh, these. Has that been increased? It's a lot faster. I don't think so. They don't have the pills that I know of that every other server has to speed up the process of that. So this is probably like a clone of the official server, but with a little bit of reworks. That would be my guess. Since I don't see them. What is the alchemy table looking like? Okay, the alchemy table is a half head. Yeah, I find it funny you can see their IDs. So you can get blue mounts out of this, get disguises. Can't still can't combat with them. Okay. I don't know what these are. They're blank for me. Are they fell slots? They could be fell slots. Oh yeah, uh, from what I saw, they have 100% success on costumes. That's that's one new thing that I've seen. They have 100% success on costumes. Um, apparently... I'm not sure if this is still a thing. Hold on. Uh, thrones and Mount uh, Seacroves have been disabled. Unlocked at a higher level. The Machinist class. Classes are disabled, apparently. I guess we'll see if we can even choose that anyway. New level 40 dungeon. Ghost disease. In Kazla? Okay. There's a guild versus guild item. Treasury. Oh, it's an NPC. And there's new wards inside of a VFS as well. So far, that seems to be the only thing. And that was like... In March. Was that, was that last info? 
Uh, let's see when our last update was. The last announcement was yesterday. They do have AFK punishing as well and banning for being AFK inside of PvP. Micros cheating and no animations, which has been the, the common thing at the moment. I've even seen it inside of the private servers to where people would micro and turn off animations. I bet I'm I'm looking at this as we go. To be honest, it doesn't seem like there's been too much information. Of like any new things. I think they started this year on January the 1st, is what I want to say. A lot of other stuff that I'm trying to like figure out what's going on is out of their Discord. Because there's a num number of things that seem interesting. Like some people have the have the final boss that looks like a pet. Oh, that's um Shigigami. So Shigigami can summon the final boss? Is that what's going on? Is that what that is? I guess they changed uh, the model for it, maybe? I don't know. It's going to be a lot of interesting things to look at. It's like I said, I was going through their Discord and everything before I started, but there's even a few more things that I've missed, apparently. But uh, I'm going to go back and forth between these servers and see what's up. I'm not going to compare them. I'm not going to do that. But I will compare like what things they... Well, I guess I, guess, I, guess I will be comparing a little bit. But I'm not going to be like actually comparing like this has... This is better than this or anything. Uh, so I will say if they have something similar to a different server. I say, like I said, it seems like the official server, but with better pricing. <laughs> and you could buy the titles that are no longer available on side of uh, the official server because Rogue Knight is no longer available because that was a CM wish exclusive uh, I'm pretty sure this is a CM exclusive as well what is VIP VIP is still the same yeah, that's still the same. So they still have the whole slots for the Nucleus as well. They also still have that. Wait, is S a thing for them? Okay. So S is only not available for um, memory server at the moment. So we do got Thrones, okay.
I will say this. So far, out of all the servers I've seen... Oh shit, we're going our own way. Out of all the servers I've seen, the most active one is Violet. In terms of their GMs and CMs. GM or CMs, whichever one. Their staff is a lot more present. And not only that, that they're just present, they are more involved with the community, like around talking, doing events and stuff like that. That's what I can definitely say out of all of them. I said, I don't know too much about this server. It seems like the other two servers are more active inside of their Discord than they are in-game. But memory, memory's like staff are in-game. They just don't seem talkative, <laughs> very talkative. Traveler. Oh, yeah. Okay, so Machinist definitely isn't available. Okay, that's interesting. But you guys thought I was going to choose anything else? Come on now. <laughs> you get your hopes up a little bit too much if you think I'm going to pick any other class right now. You 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 literally came to somebody who only knows Drew. <laughs> okay, so this one doesn't have a uh, free skill purchase, and plus you can oh, you can have light guard early. That's a thing. Not only that, I don't think reincarnation is reincarnation even a thing on the server. I guess that was that's a different thing. It doesn't have reincarnation, or you don't have to wait into reincarnation. I guess we'll see because there's a certain NPC that you can actually like look at and tell if the game has reincarnation. So let's look at this. Okay, so this is weapon based, not hammer based. Oddly enough. This is magic based, okay. And this is staff based, so basically still the same as the private server. So I would want to go staff. I want to go staff. Okay, so oh, oh okay. Here, here we go. So now we get a mount that we can use. It's a battle mount that you can use at level 40. Okay, now we're getting to the rewards. There we go. So, there's also something else I want to try in a few seconds. So, at, is it OCA? OCA. Okay, so yeah, it auto adds stuff from your inventory to your archive. So it just put three items in there. That's actually nice if you like collected a whole bunch and you want to, you know, archive out. Like if you get, um, let's say, let's say you get all of these and there's two of them stacked on top of each other and you want to make sure you max out your collection first. You just push that command in, adds all those in there so you don't have to like, you know, Sort through them all and see what you do have and see what you don't have. That's nice. Um, I wonder if they came up with anything to defeat the annoying... Uh, putting in an item one at a time for the sprite skills. That was always very annoying. 
Well, I can say one thing. I'm gonna have to suffer <laughs> with uh, the fact that um, everything is gonna be costing money again. Everything's gonna be costing gold, man. My gold is not gonna survive purchasing skills. Sag, man, it, it sucks to see, but you know, it has to be that way. Since I don't have a staff yet, I guess I would have to put this on. Uh, I guess I can go get the book I normally always get. Okay, so they haven't changed anything from the beginner card. The beginner card is still the same. But it's actually nice that you get a free combat mount, though. That's actually huge. But you have to be level 4 to use it, but still. Uh, well, it's only last 7 days, so that's also another thing. Gotta keep in mind. Really don't know, like, how... Well, nah. Yeah, you're gonna have to farm fast to get the most out of it. Because as soon as you use it, you're, you're pretty much locked in. Damn, I feel slow. <laughs> no. Uh, I was spoiled by the movement speed of uh, Violet. It's that and Memories. Memory speed boost was freaking amazing. Uh, the idea I do like the most is having all mounts being level 100 speed. Well, not level 100. 100% uh, speed. I do like that idea from Violet. Oh yeah, I had to be in a certain area for this. I forgot. This is this is new Grand Fantasia. Where they reworked the starting area. Oh shit. Go to Jasmine first, because we have plenty of time to get that quest turned in. Just give it to him back on the way down. I'm kind of sad that they didn't just, you know, make this a separate little temporary mount that you can use. Like, right away. I guess working for it feels good too, unless you end up with um, a mount <laughs> early. We still gotta remember we have the chicken mount, but the chicken mount is in combat. Oh, this is gonna be weird. I just realized that I get the level up with the remake. Well, with the where you are. Of Druid, because I never got to do that. Because this calculates in my uh, magic value. For my heals now. If anybody can remind me, does I. Uh, Oh, that. Nice. 
do heals crit? I don't remember if heals crit. Alright, time to depart. I guess what we will do... Should we do gel first? Or should we do the Kazao route again? I guess we should keep the same thing going. Okay, this one actually lets you choose. Kazao or gel? Well, Kazal has the new dungeon, so what? Yeah, freaking. We'll, we'll just keep going down the same route. I want to get to Kazal as soon as possible because Kazal normally has all the new NPCs and stuff like that, since it's one of the main cities. It, well, it is the main city, is what I should say. You you cease this activity. Stop this. Turn off events. Thank you. I wish there was a way to tell if if you're getting, you know, more XP than usual. I said it doesn't show up anywhere, so you can actually like truly tell how much you're getting. Unless. Does that count? I don't think that counts. I forgot, yeah, the maximum is. 500 percent. Okay, so the dark sprites are still a thing. So I won't expect any dark sprites in the main city. Is what I would say. I forgot how annoying that is to listen to dark sprites spawn. does this actually take? Quite a bit. So I am gonna have to use exactly what I was thinking I was gonna have to use. The spray helper a lot. I don't have any need for the healing potions, really. Yeah, let's say 25%. I think we should be good with that. God, it feels slow, man. It feels so slow, man. <laughs> Uh, I've been pampered too much. Wait, wait, wait. Test. Are your sprites fast? Oh, they are. Nice to see. Okay, sprites are fast. 
you love to see it. I can get rid of that, but I'm going to keep this since it's level 100 and under. We got how far you guys are. Jesus. This definitely does help out if you want to play Archer. Archer is definitely one of the faster characters that you can like very much deal with. This is basically the the official server, but with a lot of quality of life added to it. for the speed bar. <laughs> I wonder if we're still a mana battery. Other than just having a mana spring. Because don't we still have a holy shield, right? Oh, not holy shield, what is it called? Uh, yeah, Aegis. Ooh, no. Aegis no longer gives mana. Fuck. This does, though. Some of the lower cooldown than I actually remember, though. Now, oh, there is a uh, reincarnation. Because, uh, this. This exists. This is actually extremely freaking good. If you want to play, like, healer. <laughs> if you want to play, like, main healer type of situation with, a uh, Druid. Druid's actually really good for that. I would just say build cast time if you can. Because it benefits mostly off of cast time. Well, casting speed, I guess that would be the most appropriate way to say that. Whoops, wrong button. Fat finger. You want to talk about my fat finger incidents? Uh, we should take that off and guard farming here. So, interestingly enough, this is the only server that doesn't give, um... Armor. Uh, legacy armor. So far. We'll have to see what our first job changed out. First job changes normally where that kicks in. I don't like that this is under there. Oh, duh, because I didn't have it like that. I never had it like that. I, I normally have it like this. Bacon Eater over here somewhere. What? No Bacon Eater? Wow, 
But I can't say the weapon physical is still pretty good just because of staff. His physical melee. Is that big an air? No, that's not it. Another reason to do uh, outside areas first. That is something that puts me off because I I would think wouldn't you have times two sprite as well? Considering that's also most players uh, pet peeve too. Oh no, it's times four XP. But times five gold on this server. And times four drop. Okay. Okay, those are done. So I have to wait now. I to get past level 20 if I want to boost that. Oh yeah, that is inside of the city. I say, other than the talent, I'm really looking forward to seeing the mastery. Mastery the table is always something I'm curious to look at. Just because I want to see their form, like, you know, in game buffs. That quest are down. I guess we'll truly really see like the rates once we get past this because it starts to massively like slow down. I don't think the times have been redu reduced. Oh yeah, that's a that's a quest. Why is he active? He shouldn't be active. How does he have his HP bar? mage whoops wrong wrong crap my bad bro uh, I think that's archer right yeah that's archer can't use that 
Ooh, that's another thing I'm I have to look at too before we end up. Is there a is there auction house? Is auction house empty? Is it does it act different from the official server? Is it just you know infinite infinite days? Isn't the whole just hey you can only have this up for a maximum of two days type shit? And it doesn't charge you like a huge ass fucking fee. I always thought that was another odd thing that private servers haven't changed either. Or make it to where you can only like purchase one thing out of the stack. I don't think you'll be able to do that. Well, no, maybe you could. It would just be like... It would just take a lot of coding to do that. Okay, so that's done. Now we gotta do scavenge and bring that up. All the way up to 20. So far, so good. Decent pace. Other than speed, but yeah, decent pace of um, Sprite and progressing so far. And we're level 9, matched up with this area of when we we're supposed to leave. Oh, they still have the they still have the bug. The sprite bug. So this bug is also inside of a uh, the official server too. To where I'll keep doing this. Just click detail back to sprite then it'll show up. There you go. That's also how you get a uh, airy crystal powder if you're a new player wondering how you even grab that that's how yeah that's not the right one right yeah that's katana's Ugh. so another thing i'm curious to ha to see how they handle is um Sprite, not Sprite XP, um, this, Reputation, is Reputation also multiplied? I wonder, because that's also a pet peeve for a lot of people inside of the official server. So they said their costume is 100%, which makes me wonder. Brother, that is 100% blind. I want you to know that. I guess that's why they reworked it to take longer, because, because of the 100% blind. So there's uh, two forms that you can take that will give you the most benefit. Uh, wolf form is alright, but it is in my opinion it's it's okay good fast killer mostly used on enemies that have a gimmick of hey we hate physical but not so good on enemies that are like hey we love physical <laughs> bird form is just overall the best form for clearing oh shit I have to take this back to Marcus. But, um, Gorilla Form is good for bosses. Hands down, good for bosses because it's very, 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 very tanky. And has very good skills for tanking. I'm talking about the rework version, at least. For the other private servers, it isn't reworked. It is their own little spin-off of their stuff, but yeah, for this and the private, well, no, this and the official server. Gorilla form and bird form are the best. If I was to actually like rank them, bird form first, gorilla form second, wolf form third.
The reason I say bird form is just because it benefits from everything, every passive that you have. The only thing that kind of kills bird form is that it loses its heal and is now replaced with a AoE movement speed for everyone. Form no longer has a heal enough. I, I'm gonna be interested <laughs> in whatever server allows me to freaking use some of my abilities inside of my forms. God damn it! Cause it's kind of like, how do you, how do, you, how can you not use your abilities once you transform? I, I just. I don't know, man. I just never understood that. Oh, why am I not talking to... What's her name? Jessica. Oh, no. That's not Jessica. Royal Special Agent. Okay, I guess we get to go see what's in Kazda. Oh, yeah. If you have a gold, you can do this. For an achievement. Here's call. Because she just puts you back right there. You you basically been scammed. Congrats. You scammed yourself for for just a little bit of uh of your goat. Oh, they're advertising uh casinos. That's something I like to see with uh these uh private servers. Is the creative um God, look how gloomy and dark that looks over here. Versus this. But I guess I guess that's fine if he if he wants to hide all that. But um I like to see the whole creative loading screens. It looks very nice. Wait a minute. Do not tell me. Is it a thing again? For some reason, I feel like it's a thing again. For some reason, in earlier memory, was there not city evasions? To where you could lose access to the city. Well, not lose access to the city, it was like... A city event to where the city would actually get invaded and there would be enemies around for some reason i have a very very vague memory of that okay here's some uh NPC sprites what in the fuck is all this okay that's a broken npc that's a broken npc i think it's because i don't have a uh, chinese letters so it's not like processing things right. Hey, buddy, what are you doing here? That would be my guess. Damn, I gotta figure out how to do the whole Chinese letter thing again. But yeah, there's one person, level 50. Yeah, there's IDs everywhere. I'm pretty sure it's because of ch the Chinese letters. Novelist Spirit. Wait, are you, uh, what's his name? Oh, no, you're not. The Travel. Oh, wait a minute. So every server I've been to does not have the Traveler that gives you a free daily buff. That sits right there. The fuck are you? Sky Falcon Star? You look pretty neat. Oh, I fucking hate you. I hate you with a passion. Because this boss is from the theater. So is the, um, the Will Princess over there. 
It's pretty neat that they got NPCs running around now. But honestly, correct me if I'm wrong, it wasn't for any other veteran players that are like really old, old veteran, veteran players. Did we not? That sky is fucked. <laughs> did we not have um, city invasions when at like very, very early stages of the game release? I don't know why I have this very vague memory. I think level 50 is the highest you can go so far from what I've seen, or unless those are PvP characters. Okay. Our auction house is dead. Mega dead. Unbelievably dead. Infinitely dead. Crazily dead. That's weird, man. They have so many people inside of their, uh, Inside of their Discord. But, um. Yeah, they have a shit ton of people in their Discord. But. But. But they don't have a lot of people in game at the moment. interesting because most of them are like playing League of Legends Grand Theft Auto like stuff like that playing Rust Valorant PUBG FIFA like holy shit they're like they're they're online but they're not but they're not Playing. I wonder why. Like, what's what's going on here? Okay, the costumes are pretty cheap, which is great to see. So pretty much on par with um memories sell prices pretty much for costumes if not cheaper that's throwing me off how do you how do you guys not have more players with how the discord is Do everybody just hop on at a certain time? Am I updated? Okay, hold on. Let me restart the game because I feel like I'm not up to date or something. I say, is that is that the case here? Hold on, hold on. I know you guys are getting blinded. That's just the effect that this program has. Okay, we start the launcher again. Damn it, gotta retype stuff. So. Also, what's going on? Oh, the courtesy call. 
Ups. 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 <laughs> Sorry, my eyes don't work like they used to. Now it seems like I'm up to date. Oh no, okay, that, there we go. It changed a lot of uh, things. So once you download the launcher itself, you grab the latest, the latest quick update. You put it in, then it changes the stuff. Okay, nice. Nice, 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 nice. Makes me a little bit curious now. Okay, so this has a chance of going off three times. Has a chance of going off three times. Okay, yeah, there we go. Abilities are actually being translated and stuff. Because this sort of fuck wasn't translated. Sadly, this is the new <sighs> Nature's Wrath, which is disgusting. It is only a one hit now, because you you can't heal, stun, heal, stun off of that anymore. Which is sad. Because some abilities, for some reason, weren't translating. Weren't translating right. Now, I forgot this changes into like HP regen. If only it still lasts for yeah, still lasts for eight seconds. Goes on cooldown for a ten. This makes me curious now. Like, can I look at these now? Okay, now I can look at these. Okay, that's the fuck. Oh, oh, I do say this might actually be fucking interesting. Okay, okay, there we go. That's the new interesting part. It got rid of a lot of the errors and stuff too, <laughs> which is nice. Now I can actually see these guys. I don't think I missed anything like highly that I know of. Uh, what's going on here? It's still the same. This is still the same. That's still the same. Okay. So um, we got some staging stuff. Okay. Okay. She's still walking around. Tube stock, fame items. Okay, so all the fame items are here. Uh, you can buy all the potions here. Okay. You buy all the ammo there as well. Buff stuff. Okay. I almost read that as butt stuff and I got concerned. I was like, wait a minute, hold on, what's this? <laughs> then you got your uh, talents and everything. Okay. So I can actually look at all the talents and see. Uh, what I will be able to get in the future. Let's see if they changed anything, really. And we're still the same. What about, uh... Okay, HP is still... Wait. Feels like someone else physical crit. That's all crit now. This is one of ours. 
Yeah, because this goes into magic crit, but this one's all crit. That is strange. Ah, here we go. Um, channel channel magic was great because of the regen as well. Like I said, druids turn into real like mana batteries, but wolf form will still for some reason tear through that mana like it's fucking nothing into the official server like that class literally sits there and says mana who nah we don't need that that doesn't exist here okay 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 What's going on with you? Elder's Dream. So this is a new dungeon. Uh, this right here is the dungeon. Alright, does not exist. Okay. That's time gated. Okay, they do have theater. They have removed theater. I was wondering if they removed those NPCs. Will theater be gone too? Uh, event NPC. What if they ever change these NPCs? Well, that's actually nice. You can actually buy those bags. Oh, they've been enhanced. Those are level 25. Well, no, those are 25 slots. Ah, here we go. Okay, so more stuff has been added here since uh, changing. Yeah, magic bag with 40 slots. God damn. <laughs> Thirty slots. Okay, okay, okay. Now we're seeing the full potential. So once you download the game. Put the patch in. All you gotta do is literally have the uh, PBE folder extracted, download the fast update, drag everything out of the fast update, and just throw it into the PB, PBE folder. Oh, this is interesting. You could transform. Okay, yeah. Okay, so they have the same idea as um, memory. Or either they did this first and memory went for it as well. I'm not sure. But either way it goes, they have it as well, where you can transform into something. You can't uh, preview it at all. Okay, so if you want a tank version of it, you can get a tank version of it. If you want an attack version of it that does more damage, you can. I don't like getting anything that I can't like actually see. Legacy gear hasn't been changed in any sort of way. That's still the same. Here's the sprite pills. Are those still the same too? Yep, those are still the same. Hasn't been changed in any type of way or haven't been enhanced either, it seems. Okay. Okay, that that does 
That's interesting not seeing uh, the pill choice for faster sprites. Sprite crafting and stuff like that. But it is interesting to see that you can get your... Uh, that you can just straight up buy your uh, specialized points now. After level 45. That's the thing. Oh, now we can actually uh, look into this and see what's all in here. Okay, so there's some items without texture. Well, without, uh, not texture. Without their coating, I guess. Oh, that's looking neat. I love that mount. Ah, it's not a combat mount, sadly. It doesn't seem like there's any combat mounts in here. A baby carriage? What the fuck? <laughs> That's probably why the, uh, some of those uh, commands didn't work. Because I wasn't updated. Okay, so these haven't been level locked either. Because, uh... What was there? Violet hasn't changed their whole level lock thing. So they level locked Nucleus inside of Violet. Hasn't been level locked here. And it seems like it still has the same effect because inside of memories they removed all the extra stats that nucleus give you and it only gives movement speed. Okay. So nucleus is more of an S alchemy thing, apparently. Which is odd. I was about to say, is that my favorite armor? It is not. It's not the one I was thinking of. Sag. But yeah, seems like uh, from just for today, for what I see, it's going to be M Alchemy is for costumes, for faster costume making. You can get some pretty neat rewards out of this. Oh, I thought that was the goad bar at first. But no, it's actually like crafting material. So there's a lot of crafting material in here, actually. All abilities plus 1%. Okay, that's neat. neat. But this, this is, this is awesome. I like this. Wait, does it give everyone? What? Okay, so I would have to buy... This one and this one and this one. <laughs> so that's about 600 gold. Nope, 400. Nope, 800 gold because I'll have to get that too. Damn. Um, I have a lot of gold earning to do. A lot of gold earning to do. I wonder if there's any more NPCs that I'm missing. you take them to an actual, like, area? Oh, you do? Oh, that's weird. Oh, fuck that guy. Bet you won't kill me, though, loser. Ah! <laughs> I was joking, what the fuck? <laughs> Okay, pretty neat. So you can actually test your your characters against actual like bosses and shit. Like very annoying bosses, like this fucker here. Oh, you can see how strong you are for each uh each stage of uh what well, got out of my brain for some reason. BSF. BSF. DSL. You're level 30 DSL. <laughs> ah, no. 
God, I hate fucking reflection. Not only that, he regens HP for a second too. So that's a DPS check boss. So you, you would legit, mm, you would legit have to build all types of all damage reduction to avoid that. That's interesting now. Wait, why did I roll that much? Before? Oh no, that didn't heal me. That healed them. Just to be able to test healings and stuff like that. Huh. I actually like this. This idea right here. That's that's actually extremely neat that you can come in here and just, you know, test against like so many damn puppets of different variety and the bosses of the final tables. Well, the final um, floors. That's actually extremely fucking neat. God damn. Oh, and plus I can also teleport away. You teleport to different cities as well. That's actually nice. That's dope as shit. I like that. I very much love that. That was cool. What else is in cool? Opened up my book and figuring out that I, I still have to pay this <laughs> <is> for them. <laughs> Damn it. I thought I was God's free on that one. Apparently not. Alright, so yeah, that's that's basically it for uh checking out some of the newer stuff it seems. I don't think there is anything else. That I know of. If you guys have played uh, this server, do let me know anything else I need to check out immediately. Guess there's no need for this if you can just go down there and just buy that one. There's gonna be a lot of gold saving. Like, crap ton of gold saving. Like, even if you get those uh, sprites, the crafting on it, like, crafting is still gonna be pretty costly gold wise. You have anything there? Okay, no, you still have those stuff. Uh, what about you? Okay, so you do have the whole mount and throne thing. Where you can star and stuff like that. That might be a little bit harder to get to. Uh, I am looking forward to the first dungeon now. Just to see how much gold it actually like gives. I'm going to go collect uh, this archive. But yeah, that's what we're going to end it off. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys uh, tomorrow for some more. <sighs> Sorry, I had a good stretch coming in. For some more uh, Violet. Then we'll jump back to this the next day. But that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out.